On Monday, September 25th, a tech CEO named Pavel Lepe, who's 26, was found on the rooftop of her luxury apartment building in Baltimore, dead. She was found partially closed, as well as brutally beaten with blunt force trauma wounds. As for those wounds, we don't know exactly what they entail, as the family has asked for privacy, and the Baltimore police are currently abiding by that. After a two-day manhunt, Jason Billingsley, who is 32, was arrested at a train station in Bowie, Maryland, and he has been connected to several crimes and has quite the rap sheet, actually. He was convicted of a sex crime in 2013, was given a 30-year sentence for it for first-degree sex offense. He was let out in October on parole due to good time credit. So how Baltimore does it is if you get 30 days of good time, you get 30 days off your sentence. So he actually had a suspended sentence, which means he only had to serve 14 years, but he got out early after serving roughly like two-thirds of his sentence because of his good time credit. And then he was connected to a case on September 19th, which is last Tuesday, which he violently raped another woman, as well as handcuffed and duct taped a man and a woman, the same woman that he raped, and then set them on fire, as well as their apartment. And they were hospitalized along with a child for smoke installation, I believe. And so he's now been arrested. He was wanted on charges of first degree murder, as well as assault and a few others, but they have not officially announced what they have officially charged him with as of today. And they are looking to get him life without parole when they go to trial for this.